Here on this Waldo Mass applet, we're investigating factors of numbers. Now, a factor of a number is just a number which goes into that number exactly. I've got the number 6 on the screen, which has four factors, because there are four whole numbers which go into 6 exactly. 1, 2, 3, and 6 itself. Notice that 4 is not a factor of 6, because it doesn't go in exactly. Neither is 5. So, 1 is a factor of all whole numbers. 6 is a factor of 6, but so are 2 and 3. Let's look at slightly larger number of factors. 24 has 8 factors in total, and there they are. But notice that they occur in pairs. 1 and 24 are obviously factors of 24. They both go in exactly. But so are 2 and 12. And notice that 2 times 12 is 24. So if 2 goes into 24, so must 12. And so that's a pair of factors. 3 and 8 are a pair of factors. 3 eighths are 24. 3 goes into 24, and so 8 must as well. 4 and 6 are a pair, because 4 6 is a 24, etc. Uh, next one up, obviously 5 is not a factor, and then if you go up to look at 6, well, we've already got that on our list. Some numbers have large numbers of factors. Some numbers, the prime numbers, only have two. 1 and the number itself. This is the prime number 83. But it's true of any prime number that you will get just two factors. Some numbers are square numbers. And look at what happens here. Well, I'll leave you to investigate that and to think about why uh, the factors of a square number have this pattern here. Also, let's go back to our number 6. You may have noticed that it's marked as a perfect number. Well, this is a piece of research you might like to do, because on the internet uh, you'd be able to look up perfect numbers and it'll tell you uh, what they are and how important they are in the theory of numbers. There is one more perfect number on this list, but I'll leave you to find that one.